Hello to you all dear guys and happy valentine in advance. Do you have any plans for this day? If not, continue this video and we will learn a beautiful heart necklace that is easy, affordable and just perfect for this day. For making this heart wire pendant, you just need a one millimeter wire 0.4 or 0.5 wire and also your main tools round nose pliers, chain nose pliers and wire cutter. I have drawn the design that I have in mind in a piece of paper so that it would be so clear what to do and helps a lot to start. So first of all we pick up a one millimeter wire here we need to make a heart shape but from this point till this point we have coilings it means we could make this coiling parts and then form it like a heart shape so let's make a coil with our thinner wire. To start coiling, leave four or five centimeters and then with your thinner wire of about 0.4, just make knitting and coiling. As we talked in previous videos, just make a round loop that is just fit onto the main structure and you could use your tools like round nose pliers or chain nose pliers to do that better and easier so we start making this coiling part and you know that we're doing this you need to use your thumbs and your nails in a proper way you just straight it up with your nail and then round it and wrap it all around the wire and then with your index finger just push it just like this you could do that with a tool that we had in previous videos just like this one or you could do that directly on the main structure that we have and then continue that to better doing that this part you could fix it with your tool your chain nose pliers and then start to wrap it all around the main structure and every time that you're knitting the wire just fasten it up with pushing with your nails of index and thumbnail just like this wrap it all around the main structure and every time you pull the wire to straighten it up just like this after coiling about a four to five centimeters it's the time to wrap this part and make shape here just in about a one centimeter make a curve just like this we need another band but be careful we don't use round nose pliers or any other tools that make damages here and we lose the shape of this coiling part and again with your thumb shape this 
part so that we achieve a heart shape here. Okay. Something like that is okay and perfect. And now this is the time to cut this strand of wire and we cut it out in about four centimeters. And here At the intersection point of these two tails, we need to bend the wire completely into itself. It's like this, a complete bend, and then push it. And now form the wire with your thumb a little so that you could make a swirl at the center part with your round nose pliers round the wire and make a loop here little by little do that and then push it okay now with this part you can decide to add different designs let me pull it back and place this strand just here and then push it back like this and now you could decide to form it just a little different maybe like this and now we continue weaving but this time we have two row of wire and we are going to make a different pattern this time we make a tie that embraces both of these wires and we do that twice you could use your round nose pliers to do that better and then push it now insert the wire between these two and make a loop in between make a tie here and continue doing that with a specific pattern for example one double one double knot and then a single one then again double and single or double double and until the end you continue this pattern here I decide to do that double single double and till the end I would do that so I have finished this pattern of double single double single and again double and now for the other part we could do that 
just like the other part and make a symmetrical pattern and you could just roll the wire around the main structure and I think to repeat this shape in the other side so we should make another bend here a complete one and we would push it a little so that it won't touch the other wire okay now we could make it rounded and make a spiral I think I should Make it a little shorter with your round nose pliers. Make a loop and then round it all around to make a swirl shape. And then push it. this and let's make it a little more alike the other part do some perfections okay we could cut this part also to have a more similar shapes in two sides then okay and let's do the same weaving parts and while you're wrapping for the other two and for this part and we're continuing the same pattern at this side I mean single double or double single double single and we continue to this part and this is the end we cut the wire out and we push it into the shape and close the wire so that there wouldn't be any open edge or part. Okay, now we could make a jump ring and add our chain to that necklace. Do you remember how to make a jump ring? If you don't, just come back to the first videos. There, I explained how to make a jump ring. And then, insert the jump ring in and close it. And now, we add the chain and insert the chain into this jump ring. And this is our beautiful wire heart necklace for the Valentine Day. And you could choose two jump ring in a way that this stands like this. I hope you would make one for yourself or for the one that you love and enjoy it so much. Thanks for watching, take care and bye-bye.